What's up guys, Brennan J. Today, we're gonna be diving the most insane tubing spot we've ever been to. Right here behind me is what I like to call Tube Mountain. Now we're in a place in Texas and all of these tubes are gonna be gone at the end of the day because there's that many people that are gonna be tubing down the river. So if you guys are new to the channel, what we're gonna be doing today is diving it down the river under all of these tubers and seeing what stuff they've lost. In the past, we found stuff like iPhones, GoPros, tons of sunglasses. Anything we find, we try to get back to the owner. However, there is a lot of trash along the way. So anytime I see trash, I'll be picking it up and we'll be disposing of that properly at the end of today's video. Video. They say you can pick out your own tubes here, and I think I like the green one way at the top. At least there's, at least there's really no way to get hurt in there. Wow. All right guys, so we finally made it to the tube entrance. This is where everyone puts in, they get in their tubes and they float all the way down. How far is the float? Two and a half, three hours. Like, what's the distance? Like three miles? Um, something like that. So we actually have Brent from Fnatic here as well. He's got his whole team. We got a ton of floats. Yeah, yeah. It's a very expensive camera equipment and a lot of water. Yeah. It, it's a great <laughs> idea. So he's hoping that his camera doesn't fall into the water. I'm hoping I don't have a heat stroke in Texas in this wetsuit. So with that being said, we're going to hop on the tubes. We're going to float down see what we can find. Ladies and gentlemen, we're doing it. Have fun floating, guys. I'm going down. Don't drop that camera. Don't get stuck on a rock or bit by a spider or something. Trap, best of luck to you. See you guys at the bottom. We got glasses. <laughs> Yeah, it's like an old speaker. <laughs> it's like an old Bluetooth speaker. <laughs> yeah, there's like I found like ten pair of glasses so far, just this little stretch. Yeah. Uh, no, they're all crusty. <laughs> This is beautiful. You gotta travel the road, wait, follow the road less traveled. We are still going down the river. Actually finding some pretty good stuff. That's a lot. That's a lot. <laughs> hey man, I'm finding tons of glasses. How you doing bro? No goggles. No goggles. Oh yeah, my mission is to find some goggles for Fnatic. Uh, he doesn't have any goggles and uh, he needs goggles to see underwater, obviously. So. I gotta look for some goggles. So far all I got is some glasses and a Bluetooth speaker for them though. There's so much ground to cover that I have to be very strategic. So I'm gonna look for things like these falling down trees, basically where tubers are gonna get into and get freaked out, flip over. And uh, I'm gonna look at all the eddies there, see if I can find anything lost. I've done really good so far, but I definitely gotta hit the hot spot areas. This is not possible. This is moving way too fast. And all my gear is down there. I gotta hold on to you. Ah, ah, ah. I almost died for one pair of glasses, so that was cool. Huh? Wait, cute. You want them? Yeah. You should rock these. Wait, no, because these are cute. Wait, these are so cute. Let me see. <laughs> oh, oh like man. All right, perfect. <laughs> These are swaggy. These are swaggy. Woo! Oh. oh man, those are old. What's up with all the red puns? That's cool. All right, so we're taking a quick break out of the water because I want to tell you about the sponsor of today's video, which you guys already know is Manscaped. Now, you guys have seen in the past the Lawnmower 4.0. If you want to get that nice, clean trim, 
But what about the guys who want to get slippery smooth down on the river, if you know what I'm saying? Manscaped now has the ultra smooth package for you guys. The new ultra smooth package has everything you need to buff, protect, and smooth your most sensitive areas. Never before has there been a preferred solution for men who want a more refined, close shave below the waist until now. When it comes to the ultra smooth package, Manscaped created a three-step system for ultra smooth care down there. Step one's the crop exfoliator. Jump into the shower, apply this gentle liquid scrub to exfoliate the area. Preempt help reduce ingrown hairs while shaving. Exfoliation. Oh, you feel exfoliated? Step two, the crop gel. Apply this unique clear shaving gel to the area to prep for a close shave. Because the gel is clear, you can actually see what you're shaving. There it is. Rub that. Oh, wow. wow. That one of the weirdest things <laughs> wow. I've ever had done Wow. Me. Oh my God. Oh. Step three. Get a close and comfortable shave with the new Crop Shaver. This perfectly engineered groin shaver has three precision blades with extra wide lubricating strips and a pivoting head for the best shave at any angle. Oh, look how beautiful and clean that is right there. Pleasure doing business with you, man. In the ultra smooth package, you're also gonna get six replacement blades for your Crop Shaver groin razor. So if you're a guy like me and you wanna slip and slide down the river all day long, here's my strat. I go with the Lawnmower 4.0, take the edge off of things, and then come back with the ultra smooth package and uh, then I get to slip and sliding down the river. And you can too. So if you've got the balls to try something new, give Manscape a go and try their new ultra smooth package. You guys can save 20% off plus free shipping when you go to manscaped.com slash jigging. Thank you Manscaped for sponsoring today's video. There are a bunch of tubers coming down, so let's get back in the water, see what else we can find. It's worth it. <laughs> it's worth it. Okay. Wow. I've never been on Brandon's channel before. All of these tubers that are coming down are going to get funneled into this little tiny piece of the river back here. So I'm going to throw the goggles on, dive. This is where people are going to flip and stuff like that. So this is our hot spot. <laughs> Guys, we freaking did it! <laughs> We freaking did it, man! No way! <laughs> no way! That was awesome. I found this phone and a pair of glasses right behind, beside it, so somebody had a really bad day. This is your phone? <laughs> oh no, this has been down there for a minute. What are the odds of that? <laughs> Dang, that's freaking sweet, man. Look wow. at that. Oh, this is an Android. Definitely not my phone. <laughs> In these. <laughs> Shoot. Oh, you got it out of the case. How's it look? Looks good. Oh, it does look good. Ooh. Water case. Dang. That's never good when you're blowing the tube on the water, man. <laughs> that's never good. All right, we got a jewel so far in the rapid. This is the very beginning. It goes that way pretty far, so we'll see if we can find anything else. You watch the videos? That's awesome, man. Thank you. What's your name? Nice to meet you, man. We got two pair of glasses right down this river, too. This indeed would be a wetsuit. <laughs> that was a very good guess. <laughs> hey, y'all have a good one. Enjoy, guys. What do you got there? Wetsuit? <laughs> hey, I'm also on a tube. If you're curious, this oh, is a there's, tube. There's two of them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, we are. Oh no, we're going in. We're going into the bushes. We're going down a serious rapid now. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. This is serious. Oh boy. Oh boy. I can't dive this one. This one's a little too hardcore. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. What a nice day on the river. <laughs> oh man. There's definitely a phone in that one, but it's way too uh, strong for me to try to dive it. What kind of glasses are they? They're uh, brown ray man. All right. I'm guessing those are not it. Okay, perfect. That guy back there, he asked me to find his glasses. He just lost them. 
we searched the whole area and unfortunately I found two other pair of glasses that weren't his. Obviously, these are super old. And we got a jewel, so it seems like uh, every time someone sees me pop up from the water, like, hey man, I lost something right here. Uh, I've been finding a lot of stuff for people today. Oh no, how long ago was that? 10 months? 10 minutes. Oh, 10 minutes. Shoot, where exactly was it? Alright, alright, I'm sorry. It's gonna be hard to get back there. See what I mean? They lost the iPhone right there. It's a lot of stuff being dropped today, but I mean, that's good news and bad news at the same time, so we're just gonna keep floating down, but I mean, this place is littered with stuff. Oh. All right, well, I pressed the record button. Oh! No, bro. All right, I pressed the record button a little late, but we went through some serious rapids back there. Yep, those guys. I uh, I know there's probably a couple iPhones just sprinkled down over here, but I have been getting beat up by the rapids all day, so I'm just enjoying it now. Yeah, we need a couple more of those, right? <laughs> it's been like a little dry of a ride, you know, but a little rapid helped out. Dude, I found this fishing lure. Look at this freaking thing. That scared me so bad. So far, I got glasses and an earring under the rope swing. All right, so we just got to the tube exit. I'm not gonna lie, I was probably in the water maybe a quarter of the time. I found myself floating on the tube a lot, talking to Brent and just hanging out, having a good time. But we did find a lot of stuff for the amount of time I was in the water, so I wanna go ahead and show you those finds. So I've got everything organized in sections. Right here is kind of the odd ends. Um, this water does look like I'm drinking this water. That's because I actually found this water. It was capped off. I've been drinking it the entire trip, and yes, I did find this in the river. So we've got that. We've got this hat, a can. We've got a Bluetooth speaker. This thing obviously doesn't work anymore. We've got the banger of the day. We've got this phone. We found it in the rapids. It's in this like nice otter box case too. It is, it's some type of blue Samsung. I'm not really sure, but considering the back of the phone is uh, kind of coming apart there, don't think we're gonna be able to save that one find the owner. Gotta watch Allure, and I've got this crazy assortment of all these sunglasses. I gotta say, Trav, these are probably my favorite. And to keep it true on the tiny Texas tour we've been on, we're gonna rock some treasure shades for the rest of the day. And of course, you guys know we find tons of vapes. This time we only really found three and a cigarette lighter and whatever the heck this is. So we did find quite a bit of stuff, especially for only being in the water for maybe 30 minutes total. Probably missed out on a bunch of treasure, but I'm super pleased with what we have. I will say, San Marcos, whoever is like keeping this place clean is doing an amazing job because this is the only can that I found in this river. And normally we're pulling out more trash than treasure. And today it was all treasure and only one piece of trash, which is absolutely crazy. We gotta get you some glasses, dog. His girlfriend at Victoria actually took a pair of treasure glasses as well. She she, did. she, she loved them. She that was, was her favorite pair of glasses yeah, so. I mean, she's ever had. <laughs> she was like, they're so cute, I'm gonna wear them. Yep. So we gotta get you a pair, dog. You gotta go down there and pick one out. I was taking the same thing, bro. <laughs> you definitely cannot see it. I thing, can see right? everything. <laughs> All right, guys, well, that's going to pretty much wrap it up for today. I've never tubed a place quite like this. We're going to call this Tube Mountain just because the beginning of this place was the most absurd Tube Mountain I've ever seen. If you guys like today's video, make sure you drop a thumbs up. If we hit, how many likes? What's the like goal? What's the like goal? Uh, I thought we were saying like 115,000. 115,000 likes. Wow, shoot for the stars. All right, if we get 115,000 likes, then, I mean, I'll do whatever you guys want at that point. I mean, yeah. <laughs> All right, make sure to visit his channel. It's going to be linked in the description below. With that being said, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, we'll catch you on the next adventure. Peace out. Comment in the comment section below if you would ever want to buy River Treasure on my merch site, which is jiggingwithjordan.com. If you would ever want sunglasses like this from the videos, the actual treasure we find, let me know in the comment section below. If there's support, I think I want to do something like that. We've never sold treasure. We've always just kind of kept it for like meetups to show it off. A lot of you guys want stuff like this when I see you in person, so I'm curious if you guys would want it online. Let me know in the comment section below. Living. Never been better living real, real good.